So you're in Unity and you want to transfer data from one scene to another. Well in this tutorial we are going to cover how to get the text from this text and then set the value of this text to be the same as the text in the other scene. Let's get right into it. So in scene 1 we literally have text and we have a button and we have a script called getValue. Our getValue script literally stores the data from the text into a string and then loads a different scene. We're going to create another C Sharp script. We are going to call it static data. Inside this static data script, we are literally only going to have one string. It's going to be public static string value to keep. In simple terms, the static variable in Unity and C Sharp is a variable that can be shared across different parts of your game or application. It allows you to store a value in one scene or script and access that value in another scene or script without having to create an object or an instance of the class. So now let's go back to our getValue class. Before we load the scene, what we're going to do is we're going to do static data dot value to keep equals data to keep. So we are giving our value to keep variable what's stored in our data to keep string. So whenever you want to use your static variable, you need to do the name of the class, then dot, then the variable name. And then you can just assign a value like with any other variable. This is great! We now have stored the value of what we want to keep in a variable that's going to keep that data when we go to a different scene. This is perfect. Back in Unity, we're going to make one more script. So let's create a script and let's call it give value. So in this class, we are going to have just a few lines of code. This is all the code we're going to have. So make sure you have using Unity Engine.UI. We've got a serialized field text by text. This gets a reference to the text that we want to change in our second scene. Then we're going to do string new text equals static data dot value to keep. So we're retrieving the value that's in our value to keep variable and assigning it to new text just like with any other variable. And then we can do my text dot text equals new text. So this is just going to be assigning the text with this new, with the value in this string. So once you've saved your code, we're going to go to our second scene. We're then going to go to our text element. And then we're going to go back to our assets folder and drag and drop the give value onto our text element. And then we are going to drag and drop the text into the text field to give it a reference. So save your work, then let's go back to the original scene, we're going to then hit the play button. And it says this is a value. So we're going to click me and look we're in the second scene and it has this is a value. By the way I would just like to point out we have a button that's going to call the code we originally had when we started the tutorial in case you're wondering. But basically that's how you transfer a value of a variable between scenes in Unity. So thanks for being a great audience, be sure to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed and subscribe for more Unity tutorials. Thanks for watching!